painting the bottom of the dinghy because it's growing some nasty stuff. So here comes Jim. We have a friend who has left their spot for the weekend and she said we could pull up the dinghy and take it out on her dock over here because there's a bit more space than at our dock. I want to give a little disclaimer on this video just for the fact that bottom painting on a dock is not recommended. We Part of the BMP is to not do this over the water and we did not know that at the time. It actually is against the rules in our marina as well. So please look into your marina you know, rules before you bottom paint your dinghy, especially on the dock. As a second disclaimer on this video, I just want to let you know that I am 6'4", 230 pounds, and regular extra large t-shirts do not fit me very well. So I do apologize for the lower back, and I tried to keep my crack out of it as much as possible, but I do apologize about that up front. Pulling the dinghy up onto the dock and getting it flipped over was a big job for two of us. This dinghy is a beast, and my guess is it's probably around 300 to 350 pounds, maybe even a little bit more. And it was a crazy thing to try to flip over on such a narrow dock. First things first is scraping everything off the bottom of the dinghy. We didn't have that much build up which is kind of interesting considering it had been in the water for about five months but we did have some small barnacles on it and these weird like flat jelly things that we had to scrape off. <laughs> Now that I have scraped it off, it's time to uh, take a scrub brush and scrub it down. So Stephanie started doing that while I am scraping off the other side. We forgot one of the most important things at the boat, our coffee that I made that morning. So Steph is going to go over and grab it for us while I scrub down the rest of the boat. Busy day at the Poles Bow Marina. Lots of boats coming in. Skip's uh, Cascadia Sailing Club came in. They started coming in last night, and it looks like I think it said Gig Harbor Yacht Club is coming in as well. Now that we're done with the scrub brush, scrubbing it all down, we took out the Scotch Bright pads, and we use these to. Um, get more of the dirt and stuff off of it and get it real nice and clean and ready for the paint to go on.
Now that we have the boat out of the water, I had been wanting to replace the drain plug for a while because it looked pretty old. So I lifted up the boat so Stephanie could get underneath and pull the drain plug out and then take it up to Longship Marine to get a replacement. <laughs> Hey, so um, this is what the bottom of the boat looks like. We do have some, uh, we do have some uh, marks from where it's been beached. It's a dinghy. We're going to beach it some more. As I try not to drop my phone in the water here, Steph is taping up the boat so we can bottom paint. We're going to hit it with a little bit of acetone once she's done, just right up to the line to make sure that we have all of the... Uh... Watch out, babe. Don't step off. <laughs> To make sure we it's nice and clean and dry and no particles. Don't do that though. <laughs> yeah. Cleat. Alright, one side down. Still gotta do the other side over here. You really gotta make sure you don't fall off over here. That's the side I was scrubbing on. I think it looks pretty good. Is it wet still? Just like right here. Oh. Does that look like the same angle? Uh. I think it's more of an angle on this side. I think you need to come up a little bit here. I think you went right back where you were. Here, don't. Not having a house anymore. You can't just throw stuff like you do like you do in a house and you just toss it on the ground. Okay, so it's it's a little bit along this line for a while. Yeah, for a couple inches. So like... not, not that far. Ah. Like that. Yeah, that's that looks good. And now come down away from it. There. That looks pretty good. We don't need to be perfect. We're not boat painters. And it's just a dinghy. Now that the bottom is all taped off, we are ready to do some painting. Thank you. 
It's a little thin in some spots, so it's second coat time. I know you can just do one coat and that's fine, but we just we feel like it's a little thin in some areas, so Steph's gonna do the second coat because I did the first coat. It does look spiffy. We did a good job. Yeah, it looks nice. Good job. Now you can paint ours, can you? Yeah, okay. You bring it over here and put it up in the dock. <laughs> yeah. We'll get Brad and say, hey. Yeah, you occupy Brad and we'll paint the bottom. Well, I thought I was occupying him, but he walked away. <laughs> 